Hey, so I've only gone and done it <clears throat> in regards to my previous video about the Final Fantasy VII Remake. For those who claimed the free PlayStation Plus version back last year, and at the time you could only upgrade to the PS5 version if you had the physical copy. So in this video I'm going to explain how you can upgrade to the PS5 version if you claim the free version from PlayStation Plus, but then upgraded to the PS5 version because you bought the disc and now you no longer have the disc and you wanted to upgrade still because they recently just made it free for those who got the free version. This is going to sound so confusing, I know, but I finally fixed it. So this is to help you guys out. What you have to do is you have to contact Sony support. When you sold the disc, it was still telling you you needed to insert the disc to play the PS5 version. And there was literally no other way around it. It is quite frustrating, but somebody left me a comment on my previous video and told me that the way to do it was to contact Sony support. So I did, and they were super helpful. They said I'd has, I had to wait two days, and I just got an email today saying that they removed the disc from my account. So now when you go to the store, you have to go to the store. Don't go to like your library. Okay, because it was still kind of confusing. So you go to the PlayStation Store, go to Browse. And there you find Final Fantasy Remake. It says unavailable, but if you tap on it, go to the three dots. Upgrade for PS4 version owners. And then it will say game. You want to drop down to the second one. Add to library. Boom. So now that is the PS5 version. We're going to go ahead and download it. And I can't believe this has actually worked. I've been waiting for this for so long. I've just been wanting the PS5 version for such a long time. But yeah, all you guys need to do is contact Sony support. That can be a bit of a pain, but I'll also explain how to do it. Oh, what? Oh, I've got no storage. Okay, so I'll explain further. I'm going to head over onto my computer, actually, and just direct you guys to where you need to go and who to chat to just to make it easy for you. Okay, so on your desktop, or you could do this on your mobile. I would prefer on a desktop, it just makes life a little bit easier. But if you haven't, then you can do this on your mobile. If you have Twitter, again, um, you can follow these guys, Ask PlayStation UK. These are the ones who helped with my issue. You just send them a message and then they got back to me. So the message saying, I'm sorry to hear that you had some difficulties with the upgrade. So then they left me a link here. I'll leave the link in the description, but I'll click the link. And they told me to go to games and then installing and downloading. So once you're on the contact website here, click on games, install, downloading, updates and games. And then you want to go on the live chat. Don't use the Twitter because then it will just direct you to these guys and these can't resolve the issue you do have to do it via a live chat so once you do that once you're successful sometimes it can be difficult oh agent available sometimes it'll say unavailable you just have to wait uh, but depending on the time open between monday to friday 10 30 to 7 p.m depending on where you're from I'm from the uk and uh, so yeah i contacted the support via live chat Told them the problem, they said it was okay, we can remove the disc from your account. It could take up to 48 hours. And I then, I think I got an email. I don't know, I think I got an email or something saying that they had removed it. And as you can see in the video, pre in, early on in the video, I am now able to claim the free upgrade. So I hope this video helped. If it did, leave a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it. Still, if you've got any more questions, just let me know in the comments. And uh, thanks again for watching. Really appreciate it. See you all in the next video.